Yeah, like it says, gamer at work. Today I'm going to show you my office, and uh, this is, well, I call it my office, but this is my office. Fantastic. Yes, that is a bed. It's a very small room, as you can see. I'm still working to clean it up because I've had a lot of new stuff brought in a lot of new extra items and I'll start with uh, what I've got I mean this is all the uh, gaming areas you can see I've got a few Skylander figures uh, in here are like memory cards look at them there you are, see they have even got a book there memory cards uh, this one here it's like full of wires like my USBs for my guitar heroes and rock bands things and that lot so now let's move on to the consoles as you can see I have a PS3 or Xbox 360 uh, 3DS up there well the 3DS is recharging so that's uh, good uh, move on here that's these are my two recent buys a uh, Sega C Master System a Sega Mega Drive with Sega CD that's great uh, Sega, uh, Sega, what am I about? Nintendo, Super Nintendo, so that's a good buy. Uh, then we move over here with more consoles, because, except for that, that's a Skybox. Sky HD, by the way. Uh, Nintendo 64, uh, Sega Saturn, then we move down here with Nintendo Wii, PlayStation 2, and over there is an original Xbox, and in here, it's the bag box of controllers. Now, Obviously, as you can see, I've bagged them because, for one reason, wires. I mean, yes, obviously, the PlayStation 3 and the Xbox, you might say, oh, they don't have wires. Yeah, but it's just one end. It makes it feel better because I might as well, if I bagged all of them, I might, you know, if I bagged all the ones with wires, I might as well bag the ones without wires as well. So then I know. And obviously, with them being labelled as well, it would help then. Because obviously, some people might say, oh, uh, I can't find... What does a you know, say? Uh, what does a Master System controller look like? So yeah, and obviously you could say, oh, is this a Master System? No, it isn't. You dick. You can't find one, and there you go. Look, Master System controller. So it's there, and uh, that goes there. So that's all great. Bye, big TV. Awesome. I need it to play the other things play all my games and that lot, everything blah blah blah, yada yada yada. So, we've got more consoles here because I've got a Game Boy Advance and a PSP. So, now let's start on, before we do with the games, that's a few of my DVDs, there's some more around the back if you want, I could do a second one, second vid of all the DVDs and Blu-rays I've got. That will be quite worth it. Adventure. Now, before I sit down, I'll sh stand up just to show you. So you can see I've labelled them. Some of these are the ones that haven't got boxes. But obviously some I haven't. Like as you see, there's some Mega Drive games over there. Quite a few. And quite a few Master System games there. Then we go to the Sega Saturn games over here. And then we've got Se Super Nintendo. I've only filled a few and there's another lot there. Uh, Nintendo 64, there's a few there. Sega Mega Drive and Genesis. Sega Mega Drive, and I put Genesis for the Yanks, because obviously, I remember so, every time I watch some videos, people keep calling it Genesis. It's like, no, it's a Mega Drive to here. To me, it's a Mega Drive, not Genesis. Uh, Sega CDs, these were some unboxed ones, so that's why. Uh, PSPs, I've got a few, and before you ask, yes, I know I need to take some of the prices off but at the same time I've not had a chance to try them yet so there's no point me taking the price well there is a point of taking the price off but at the same time I've not had much time to take the price off there's some more PSPs there and some UMDs and obviously as you can tell they're all wrestling ones because for some strange reason wrestling ones seem to be working seem to be on UMDs and DVDs now and uh, there you can see some Game Boy Advance games and some normal Game Boy games so now let's move on, as you can see, to the PlayStation lot. I mean, this is all PlayStation 1 games. I mean, I keep finding more. I 
I go to markets, stalls and that lot, you know, like, you know, just anywhere, like, mostly it's Morecambe Market, because they still sell these, which is a fantastic place to go for all your consoles. I mean, as you can see, some of them are not in proper cases, because, like, I didn't get, the, I just got, like, the disc from, like, Amazon or places like that, or it just came, the disc was, the, you know, they, they didn't have like the proper boxes so and they sold them like this so I was like alright all right. I don't care it's, as long as the disc's playable <coughs> uh, excuse me uh, then there is more to move it on to the PlayStation 2 and before you ask yes this is a PlayStation 2 it's just the box was a special edition box and I've not been able to find this on Xbox so boo on the Xbox but yay because it is a really good game and I didn't want to throw the box away just because I don't have it so screw you if you're not happy uh, <laughs> more PlayStation 2 games here as you can see there are a lot a lot a lot a lot I have before you ask I did count them but this was a while ago and I've bought some more since then so probably after this I'll put a comment on the uh, vid saying how many of, of each I've got because now we're moving on to PlayStation 3 and obviously yeah uh, that's some snacks for later uh, I'll move that because there's some more underneath it and the only reason that's there is because it doesn't want to fit under where the PlayStation 2's are so that's a bit of a bugger on you boo on you I'd say <laughs> And I could stick it out like um, a Mass Effect here, but the problem is it it will just stick out like a massive sore thumb, and it just look better laying on you know this area. And obviously it doesn't fit on there, so it's, yeah, yeah. As you can see, and bef obviously some of them are just like empty cases, you know, like when we do there, steel disc cases because I got them free. So it's like I'm not throwing that away. I'm keep, I might as well keep it, you know, just fill up a bit of space. I've got another one back there, Re uh, Resident Evil, I'll show you that later. As you can see, more and more and more Xbox games, well, PS3 games, I'll get that right. Now we move on to the Xbox games. Some of these games are really hard to find, I mean, I know, uh, like for example, as you can see, Dino Crisis 3, I found that in the market store, well done. Uh, that was another. That was from a, a sh little shop called Lee's Games in Morgan. Great shop. Uh, that was also from the market. I mean, some of these are from market. Some of them are from like little stalls that no one gives a crap about because they think, oh, we'll go to game, they might have it, but they don't now. They just only sell like PlayStation 3, Xbox 360s, and Nintendo Wii U, Wii's and Wii U games plus the odd um, DS and 3DS. But that's it. Some do, some don't, you know, sell others, but they are more uh, Xbox games, loads and loads of Xbox games. I mean, I just could go on and on about what I've got, but it's just easy for me to, you know, especially if I have to write it all down, because it's like, ah, what have I missed? So it's easy if you can quickly see this, then it just makes it easier. And obviously, before anyone says anything, I've not had much chance. I've bought a few more, but I've not had much chance to play on them. And also, I don't want to play others. Like, they are the Assassin's Creed. I'm still working away on Brotherhood, so there's no point in me playing these two. If I know that this, these two follow on from this one, but, you know, I feel better just playing the lot. But if I've got them, then I don't have to piss about looking for them later on in the future. I mean, like this, Bioshock Infinite, I've not had a chance to play that yet. I do apologise to all the Bioshock fans. and I know I'm going to get some a lot of criticism from people saying, Oh, play the game, play the game, yeah, it's a good game, play the game. I've not had time, you dick. <laughs> uh, moving on, and yes, I know some of them I've just made, like, ch cheap-ass colours. And before you ask, no... These are proper games, they just, they didn't have covers, it was just the disc, so I just uh, borrowed a PC thing, put the thing in, you know, put the uh, proper game in and that lot, or gave me a thing with the book, so I just like, ah, there you go, or just the disc, and it'll just say, oh, this is what's in it, and then it'll be like, alright, I'll just do this for now until I make a proper one, because I've already made a few proper ones. On the PlayStation 2, like, uh, trying to find one. 
but yeah, sensible soccer. That was just a disc, and I printed one off myself. And obviously, some are available because obviously I don't want um, Command and Conquer free in Turkish. You know, Turkish or German. I want in English. You damn it. And uh, yeah, moving on, moving on, and more Xbox games. Uh, Xbox 360, I should say. Yes, before anyone asks, this is the most of the collection. Last time I checked, I had like over 150 Xbox 360 games. Does it mean that I like the Xbox 360? Yes and no. I mean, the games work well, but the problem is some of them are like... It's a case of, obviously, excluding the exclusives. Some of them, I just feel like, play better on the Xbox than they do on PlayStation 3. Like, for example, racing games, I just think they... They feel better, uh, like F1, that just definitely feels a lot better. Uh, shooting games, that feels a lot better on the place, on the uh, Xbox. Well, some shooting games, like Call of Duty and Battlefield. And that lot, but like other games, like Metal Gear Solid, I think that feels better on the PlayStation than it does on the Xbox. It's just me. Yeah, and obviously, as you can tell, I've got two Skylander games. It just saves me from buying... Well, I got into that thanks to a friend on... Um, my, on my YouTube uh, account, YouTube, well, yeah, my YouTube friends, uh, he keeps talking about Skylanders, and then I was like, hey, this sounds really clever, so I got it. Right, now over here, I only have one boxed uh, Game Boy Advance game, it's the Pac Man collection. I have some uh, DS games, I mean, some of them, some people will question, like, why do I have Deal or No Deal and Pokemon? I mean, for Pokemon reasons, I have not played it in a while. Last one I played was on uh, the colour, which was uh, yellow. I'll get there in the end. And uh, Neil and Deal or No Deal, that was cheap. That was like about, I think it was £4, if I can get it out. Come on! Well, it was £9, but it was in a sale, so it was £4. I remember I pulled the... They didn't, the guy didn't put the sticker on, so there. that's why it was not there. There's my 3DS games, and uh, as you can see, one had a uh, 3D cover, the other one is just a box standard cover, but I'm not getting rid of one just to keep the other, so screw you, I'm having them both. Uh, I need a Game Boy game for that, but that's a uh, tran uh, transfer pack, I'll get them in the end, I can't read. Uh, Sega... God damn it! <laughs> Super Nintendo, these are boxed, as you can see, I've put a boxed label there. I need to make a label for the, uh, get off that. The, uh, Sega CDs, I mean, some of them did come cheap like that. Road Avenger, I've not had a chance to play that yet, but I will, and, uh, obviously this is... Solfe, or Solfeci, or whatever you want to call it, in Cobra Commander. I've not had a chance to play Cobra Commander yet, but what I've been told, it's a really good game. And uh, obviously, uh, Nintendo 64 boxed Star Wars Episode 1 Pod Racer. Uh, a friend recommended me to get this, and a few of my other friends have re on uh, Facebook recommended me to get games like GoldenEye, and I do, they're up there boxed, so yay! I plan on that later. <coughs> Excuse me. Now we move to the Nintendo GameCubes, and some of these games, most people would say, why have you bought them? I mean, like, 18-wheeler, I remember playing that in the arcade, I loved it, so screw you. Eternal Darkness, and yes, 49p it cost me. <laughs> so, uh, I wonder how much that is on Amazon and eBay, because I guarantee you it won't be worth 49p. Uh, Luigi's Mansion, that was a game. Two Needs for Speeds, I could hardly find them on bloody PlayStation 2, was when I won, or Xbox. But I found them on GameCube, so it still counts. And uh, obviously other games that were GameCube related, like Rogue Leaders and that one. That's the only Wii game on the uh, slot because I can't fit anymore. Battle of the Bands, not had a chance to play that yet. And as you can see, if I can move the camera down, more Wii, more Wii games. Oh God, I can't even speak. I'm speaking too much. Yeah, more Wii games, and as you can see, I just prefer them to be boxed. If this was a while ago, and I just could not be bothered, like with Wii Sports, I just could not put it back in its original little shitty box. So I put it in that. And that was back when I only had one of these shelves, and since then I've bought a second shelf, which is over there. Then I bought a third shelf, 
which is over here and then I just bought all these little boxes just I just thought it made it look more nicer I mean at one end I'm gonna have to build a shelf you know a bigger shelf like take some of these pictures down I mean I know some people might say why have you got a train I like that train and I just thought it was really good screw you and a picture of Carl Fogarty uh, painting of Carl Fogarty well done painting that lot and uh, it's just things like that it's just you know screw you I'm gonna put posters down here gaming posters around here around there blah 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 yada 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 and uh, it's just things like that I mean I really I know some people might say I have a very small room and yes I do have a small room but I don't care I mean it's mine this is my domain this is my palace <laughs> my domain of destruction awaits <laughs> for no man except me anyway moving on and well there's nothing else to move on to I'm gonna have a game I'm gonna play on a game I might play on R Road Racer or something yeah screw it I'm gonna play on that <laughs> Mega Drive awaits now oh, where's the controller <laughs>